Wow, so it's been almost a month and time keeps ticking along so fast. So I wanted to give a quick life update and I try to keep Patreon up to date on things, but this will go out to uh, YouTube and uh, we're getting you know close to winter and uh, long story short, um, I've been thinking about um, getting another job for quite a while now, probably the last year or so. I've decided to go back into my career field of human resource management. So I'm a strong generalist as well as an HR leader and I have a bachelor's degree, um, did very well in school, rejoined Society for Human Resource Management to stay up on the best practices and trends and LinkedIn account has been great. Uh, for, there's a lot of uh, things you can learn on there and networking and so far um, it's been a pretty positive experience actually in that employers or my credentials are going through the filters online and they are viewing my application and, and my resume. So uh, that said, I've had a few phone interviews, I've had some one-on-one -on -one interviews, and I'm currently being looked at um, in several types of uh, companies. I'm trying to keep my job search because of winter going back to that part. You know, we want to kind of keep things simple right now. So I'm staying within a 25 mile radius of my home. So that said, it's looking pretty good. Um, you know, you look at, I'm, I'm running into a lot of different things. You know, uh, some hybrid positions, some people saying, well, you haven't had the title per se for so many years, you know, how relevant are you? And, and I think we need to always go back to what competencies do you possess that could be the right fit? See, because transactional HR is just that. You can learn it, you can brush up on it, okay? It is transactional. What you need to look at is the competencies that drive good performance, not just good, but great performance, and finding that fit for an organization. So, you know, taking the time to um, improve one's skills, um, showing you know that that you're serious about your craft by rejoining your professional organizations and things like that. These are the competencies that you need to look at and it's always between the lines in a resume. So it's insight, you know, it's it's credibility, it's it's all these things wrapped up into this. And I didn't want to make this um, a video about why I should be hired. It's just I have so much experience to give, um, to fall back on, and I'm a person that's always had high reviews. Um, I, I excel a lot of, at what I do. So that said, I would be a very good candidate for the, the right company. And speaking of, I'm being very careful also about what companies I look at. I think in today's day and age, we need to look at sustainability. Here's an example. So I interviewed a few months ago for a, a uh, HR generalist, you know, really into what I do. It's my niche, my passion, my purpose. And come to find out, you know, it was the moving industry. And the recruiter, you know, went on to say how difficult everything was a year ago with the pandemic. Everything came to a screeching halt. People weren't going anywhere. And you know what? That in itself told me that kind of industry may not be sustainable, um, you know, given the circumstances of the world or our current landscape. Uh, things are very tricky right now. So, you know, I'm able to at least look at those types of industries, the ones that I want to go in, the ones, healthcare, food industry, um, certain types of manufacturing that I know will be needed. That's where I belong. And I'm more so a greater fit on the front line, um, close to the process type HR person. Um, I've got everything in there. So anyway, that's five minutes. I just want to give a life update. So I've been focusing a lot on these things 
and uh, it's taken a lot of time and um, you know planning and 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 I know whatever happens will be for the greater good and we need to look at that as well you know what kind of jobs can I do to impart my knowledge and my skills and my competencies for a greater good and I think I'm at that point in life that I need to do that so anyway this is a uh, I'm keeping the channel. I'm doing exactly what I do. I'm doing my reactions. I've got two down for today, and uh, I've got some music. Looking forward to um, going into a new music school next month. Uh, you know what? This is all good, and it gives me that respite that I need um, in life to be more than just I'm going to a job. You know, here, 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 and that's it. Because when we are able to expand ourselves, in my opinion, a greater, more well-rounded person evolves, and that's a good thing. So I'll leave it at that, okay? All right, be in touch soon. Also, we got um, some announcements for Patreon. My mind is uh, going for that. And then lastly, Katie's Joy Live. I've uh, been doing it. This will be the fourth year, and I'm going to be uh, doing something with that. I haven't quite decided exactly how it's going to come out or what I'm going, going to do. Traditionally, it's been Christmas carols, but I might expand that a little bit. We'll see. All right? Okay. See you soon.